This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at porphyrin compounds. Porphyrin compounds are planar ring structures with extensive conjugated systems. So here we have two examples of porphyrin compounds. On the left, we have chlorophyll and on the right, we have heme. As we saw in a previous video, a conjugated system consists of alternating single and double bonds with delocalized pi electrons. Both chlorophyll and heme absorb light in the visible region of the spectrum. Porphyrin compounds are chelates of metals with large nitrogen-containing macrocyclic ligands. The porphyrin structure is made up of four rings that act as ligands. So here we have the structure of heme, and as you can see, the porphyrin structure is made up of four rings that act as ligands. The non-bonding pairs of electrons on the nitrogen atoms form coordinate covalent bonds with the central metal ion. Each nitrogen atom has a non-bonding pair of electrons which form coordinate covalent bonds with the central metal ion, which in heme is the Fe2 plus ion. Next we look at chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is a biological pigment found in plant cells. The metal ion in chlorophyll is the magnesium 2 plus ion. In chlorophyll A, the R group is a methyl group, and in chlorophyll B, an aldehyde group. So here we have the central metal ion, which we can see is an Mg2 plus ion. Just like in heme, the nitrogen atoms with their non-bonding pairs of electrons form coordinate covalent bonds with a magnesium 2 plus ion. Here we can see the R group, which in chlorophyll A is a methyl group, and in chlorophyll B, an aldehyde group. Next we look at the structure of heme. Heme is the prosthetic group of hemoglobin, myoglobin and the cytochromes. The iron 2 ion in heme can form two additional coordinate bonds with a protein residue and molecular oxygen. And finally we look at the structures of hemoglobin and myoglobin. So we'll start with hemoglobin. Hemoglobin carries molecular oxygen within the blood. It contains four heme groups, each bound within a polypeptide chain. Because hemoglobin has four polypeptide chains, it's classified as a quaternary protein. In hemoglobin, the porphyrin group is bonded to an iron 2 ion. So here we have the structure of hemoglobin. As you can see, it contains four heme groups, each bound within a polypeptide chain. And next we look at the structure of myoglobin. Myoglobin is a protein composed of a single polypeptide chain and one heme group. It is found in muscle cells where it stores molecular oxygen. In myoglobin, the porphyrin group is bonded to an iron 2 ion. Myoglobin only binds one oxygen molecule compared to four oxygen molecules in hemoglobin. So here we can see the structure of myoglobin. It's composed of a single polypeptide chain with one heme group. So let's end with a summary. Porphyrin compounds are composed of four nitrogen-containing macrocyclic ligands, which are bonded to a central metal ion by coordinate covalent bonds. Because of their highly conjugated systems, they absorb light in the visible region of the spectrum. Chlorophyll is the light-absorbing pigment in plants. Hemoglobin and myoglobin are protein molecules and are able to bind molecular oxygen. Hemoglobin transports oxygen in blood cells and myoglobin stores oxygen in muscle cells.